Hey guys, Roxy Saran here. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about the important topic of what is the actual difference between an essential oil and a carrier oil? And really, why does it even matter? And why do you want to know and make sure that you are not being scammed? Yes, a lot of people put fillers in their oil, so I'm going to teach you how you can find out the difference between an essential oil and a carrier oil. If you're new to our channel, be sure to hit subscribe and bell notification and also the like. All right, so what is a carrier oil? Well, exactly what the name entails is it helps carry essential oils to your skin. It is usually unscented and partners very well with an essential oil. It can be used to dilute the feeling or the sensation on your skin. Some essential oils have a heating or cooling sensation, and so when you partner it with the carrier oil, not only does more essential oil bind to your skin, it helps you save money, but it also helps with any heating or cooling sensation or for those with sensitive skin, like babies or the elderly. And so I love that it has no scent and you partner it together, it'll help, help save you money and stretch your budget. So an example of a carrier oil is something like a coconut oil. I love doTERRA's fractionated coconut oil. That just means that it's broken down into fractions. It's, it takes out the fraction that makes it go rancid or stain your clothing or your sheets or um, just smell kind of funny. So doTERRA's fractionated coconut oil is excellent to use with doTERRA essential oils because again, it helps save you money. More essential oil will bind to your skin, helps with any heating or cooling sensation, and it won't ever go rancid or solid or stain your clothing and your sheets. So fractionated coconut oil from doTERRA is, is awesome to have as a um, carrier oil with doTERRA essential oils. So another example of a carrier oil would be something like a jojoba oil or a sweet almond oil, maybe even an olive oil or an argan oil grapeseed oil or avocado oil. So you have lots of choices, but not all of them maybe are gonna, um, they may go rancid or they may stain your clothing and your sheets. So just be careful with that. Again, I love doTERRA's coconut oil for that very reason. So if you're new to our channel, we welcome you here. You can always go to roxysaran.com and get started with essential oils today. Or maybe you just wanna buy one or two items. You can go ahead and do that at roxysaran.com. Okay, so what is an essential oil? Well, essential oils are known for aromatherapy, but they are just absolutely so much more. They're known as an alternative form of natural medication that is extracted straight from the plant and it helps to support your health and well being. It's extracted from the plant, so it is an aromatic compound. Essential oils are aromatic compounds that occur naturally in plants. So they're um, expressed through a cold distillation or steam distillation, depending on the particular plant or essential oil. Essential oils are very, very small molecules. So because they're plant-based and our bodies are very similar to plants, your cells don't really have to work very hard to absorb that essential oil. So anytime you put an oil on your skin, it's absorbed very quickly. Well, when you use essential oils with a carrier oil, carrier oil is a larger molecule. So when you bind together essential oils with the larger molecule, it helps just slow down that absorption into your skin. So they go very well together and I love using essential oils with a carrier oil. Now here's one thing that you need to know so you don't get ripped off. A lot of companies will sell you, they say, a pure essential oil, but really it's been diluted down with a carrier oil. How can you tell? You can tell one by the scent. When you smell it, you can tell that it, it's off or maybe not very potent. When you smell it, it smells like it's been under a blanket. Or another way you can tell is when you have to use a lot of it to get a very uh, therapeutic response. Another way you can tell is by the price. So if you see doTERRA's essential oil frankincense, the pure essential oil, there's no carrier in it at all. You can kind of tell on the, um, how fatty it feels, right? Like if it has a carrier with it, you can tell. Um, but frankincense essential oil from doTERRA is $69.50 in the US at wholesale cost. 
Well, when you go to your local grocery store and find a bottle of frankincense for $4, you can pretty much tell that that's not gonna be frankincense essential oil. So those are some of the tips of how you can know and how you can avoid being scammed. What I love about doTERRA is that we do have some essential oils that come in the touch form. That means they're already in a base of coconut oil and they'll tell you that. The price reflects that as well. And then when you look at the ingredient list, the first item there is fractionated coconut oil. So doTERRA, I love their transparency because you know what you're getting versus a lot of time other companies might be diluting their product down and you have to be the investigative one to figure out what's going on. Okay guys, well thanks for being here today. Go to roxysaran.com and let's help you get started with pure essential oils in your own home that will help stretch your budget and add a coconut oil to your order so you can uh, be your own aromatherapist and help to bind more essential oils to your skin. I hope to see you in our next video where we'll be talking about how does doTERRA give back? We'll see you in the next video.